What's up guys, so today I got something that is going to change the way I film a lot of my hunts. Mostly for dove hunting and my air gun hunting videos. So what I got is I got a Tacticam. And it's actually this mount right here which allows me to film through my scope. This is the camera right here and it looks up through here with the mirrors and I can see through my scope so I have a scope cam now which is going to be really nice. So what this is, is it's, it's kind of like a GoPro but it's made for hunting, for filming your hunts. So this is, going, this is going to allow me to film through my scope and it's also, it also has a zoom in mode which um, is going to be great for dove hunting. I can put it on the end of my barrel of my shotgun. This is my pellet gun, but it's going to be zoomed in so you'll be able to see the birds a lot better when I'm taking shots. So it's going to be, it's going to be great. So I know in my last video I said we were going to be doing some turtle jugging, but we'll be doing that in the next video for sure. So today we're going to be testing the scope cam out and we're going to try to shoot some blackbirds for some bait for the turtle, for the turtle jugs. I'm going to take some practice shots on this steel target right there and make sure I'm dialed in make sure I can hit it and we'll see how good the scope can footage is so I'm about 25 yards away from the target right now and we're gonna test um, this scope cam footage out see how it does nailed it I do not have the best rest right here I'm shaking a lot I nicked it I'll do one more shot so it actually hits the target all right there we go so let's go i'm gonna go to the sweet corn patch because there is a lot of stinking blackbirds destroying the sweet corn in there so we're going to try to take some of them out and use them for some turtle bait all right we're at the sweet corn right now and i just seen a bunch of blackbirds but they kind of flew away there's some over there so I'm gonna go ahead and get the scope cam going and I'll set you guys up right there and we'll take some shots, hopefully we can get some. Are you serious? I thought I was loaded. I think I just missed that. Now they're probably gonna be smart and not let me take a shot. Missed again. Okay, so it's really hard to get this camera going the same time I'm doing the scope cam. So I'm just going to do scope cam only for right now until I get some birds because they are not letting me get very close at all. So hopefully we can get a couple. Nailed that one. Finally. Got that one. It seems pretty much impossible to find these birds. I've shot two already and I cannot find them. I haven't found either one of them. I don't know if this is going to work out for turtle bait. If I can't get any of my kills. Oh yeah. Got him. You know when he hangs by his feet, that is a good shot. Alright, we should be able to recover this one because I know exactly where he fell. Right off of that. Man, I'm telling you guys, filming through your scope and trying to get kill shots is not as easy as it looks. This is a lot harder than I thought it'd be. Check him out. Oh, it was a headshot. Okay, so I have given up on using the scope cam for today for the for the blackbirds. I missed a lot of blackbirds and a lot got away before I could shoot at them. So I have the tech that came on the shotgun and I'm just gonna try to get a bunch of birds real quick for bait so we can have some bait. I feel like the scope cam is gonna be a lot easier for like squirrels and stuff because the birds they just fly away before I can even get a shot on them. So I'm gonna go ahead and get loaded up here and we'll see if we can take out some blackbirds or some sparrows too. That is what I'm talking about. First try, first shot, Dustin won. I'm gonna leave this guy on the path so we can come back and get him later. All right, let's see if we can get some more. Got him. I'm gonna be, oh, I was just gonna say, I was just getting ready to say I'm gonna be surprised by finding this bird. Ah, there we go, another one down. That was a far shot, took two shots to get him though. Probably 35, 40 yards. Got him. 
I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to recover this one. He landed somewhere in these beans right here. Not exactly sure where though. Oh man, that was some good that was some good shooting right there. I just got two birds with three shots. That's pretty good, especially for me. Now I just have to see if I can find them. Here's the second one I shot. That was probably 30 yard shot. I can't I don't know if I'll be able to find the first one because it landed in this super tall grass. I found him. He was right here in the trail. Sweet. That's, I think that's five down with the shotgun already. I couldn't recover the one that landed in the beams though, but that's all right. We, just, we need to get these birds out of here anyways. This is mainly just pest control, but I'm trying to use them for bait too. I just dropped two more birds and I didn't really pay attention to where any of them went because there was just birds flying everywhere. So I'm gonna attempt to find at least one of them. Well, I was looking for the other two. This guy flew over, nailed him with a headshot. Those nerves are going a little bit. I've spent about five minutes looking for these two I shot earlier, but I cannot find them anywhere. I don't know how they disappear in this grass that easily. There's some right there. Focus. We're going after him. What do you bet I won't find this one either? Cause I'm pretty sure I'm not. I don't see it anywhere. All right, so that's gonna wrap it up for today's video. I'll go and show you guys what we all got today. So we got six red winged blackbirds and it's kind of weird because all of them are females. That should be enough to set most of my turtle traps in my next video. I did get a lot more birds, but I could not recover them. They, they're just really hard to find. So if you guys enjoyed this video and the tact cam footage, leave me a like and a comment and make sure to subscribe because we'll definitely be getting some more footage out like that soon. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video when we do some turtle jugging. See ya.